Hello and welcome to another TA Tech Tip. In this tech tip, with the help of my colleague Colette Quinn, we'll demonstrate how to switch the Affinity ITC Auto into manual mode. Tools required. Filling syringe cell, filling syringe, needle, connector tubing, solutions for cell and syringe. The Affinity ITC Auto can easily switch from automated to manual operation. The first step is to change the operation mode in the software. Following this software change, the cell is loaded with the filling syringe. The low volume option load is 250 to 300 microliters in the cell, and the standard volume is 1.25 milliliters. When loading, avoid air bubbles by touching the bottom of the cell with the blunt end needle and pull up slightly. The solution is injected with a single downward motion of the plunger as the filling syringe is removed. The next step is to set up the table with the desired settings. Don't turn on the stirrer, as it will automatically turn on before the paddle enters the cell. Choose Execute the experiment. This will bring the arm to the correct position and turn on the vacuum in the syringe arm reservoir. The software wizard that is launched provides step-by-step -step guidance. One of the important points to remember when filling the syringe is the void volume. The wizard adds this volume to the total volume needed. The software will give the option to load more and keep its contents. This is a great option for loading the syringe once for the experiment and then have some titrant remaining for the background titration of titrant into buffer. Next, the filling syringe that contains the titrant is prepared. The lure lock fitted needle is replaced with the provided connector tubing. When prompted, the connector on the syringe is removed and replaced with the connector and the titrant filling syringe. Desired volume is loaded and the total volume is typed into the software. After the volumes have been added into the wizard, the plunger will close and the screen will prompt the user to swap the connector tubing attached to the filling syringe and replace it once again with the tubing attached to the syringe arm. Following this motion, the entire arm will swing into position and the stirring paddle will automatically turn on prior to entering the cell. The experiment will now begin. In this TA Tech Tip, we've discussed how to manually load the Affinity ITC Auto. Please subscribe for more helpful tips from TA Instruments. Thank you for your interest.